The Baker Baker Effect. It's a study they've replicated it many times and it always has the same result. And it's all about association. They take a group of people and they tell them, hey, we're doing this study, and they lie to them about what the study is about. They want to see how many people are going to remember someone's name. Okay? But you can't tell people at the outset, because then everybody tries a little harder. So instead, they tell them the study is about something else. People come in. At some point during the study, they get introduced to Mr. Baker. And later on, at the end of the study, every individual is asked, do you remember that person's name? And they're shown a photograph of him, and almost everybody forgets, 90% or more. So again, if you forget names, you're in good company. What's interesting is group number two. And they're introduced to the same guy, but they're not told his name. They're told his occupation, that he's a baker. Now, he's not dressed like a baker. He's dressed casually like most of the other people in the room. But they happen to be told at some point that his occupation is a baker. And what's interesting about this group is when they're asked at the end of the study, hey, what do you remember about that guy you met? Almost everyone remembers he was a baker. So this is what they call